Yeah, we are back, playing more <coughs> here at this Lord of the Dead. Last time we uh, started off with this party, the Shade party. We're playing on the hardest difficulty, by the way. And uh, yeah, I think we'll just <laughs> continue on here. Uh, I will explain some concepts as we go, but again, if you're very interested in uh, like a video where I go through all the basics, then check out the link down in the description. So here we have a battle coming up. Let's jump into it. <laughs> By the way, if you have any recommendations of games that you're playing right now, I'm currently looking for the next game to play. I will probably play, or at least try out, um, Vow, Vow, or how do you say it? World of Warcraft, classic. <laughs> I'll probably try that out at least, uh, and see, see how I like it. Uh, I remember I played during the beta, but <laughs> anyways... We're playing Eurotus right now. So these guys have a kind of a good chance hit, 120% chance. But it's not super high. If I remember correctly, the Elite Doomsayer... Uh, the Doomsayer has one dangerous ability, if I remember correctly. That's about it. These guys... I mean, this simple miner we could probably bring down quite click quickly with either Soul Leech or First Doll. I think we go Soul Leech on this guy. Was it quite fast to bring him down that way? Uh, and then we do minus accuracy. <laughs> minus accuracy. So much minus accuracy. And yep, just keep shuffling them around. Huh? Oh, he's at 60. That's pretty good. Especially since we also have 70% evasion on our guys here. 60 there, 60 there. That's not too shabby. Hopefully he misses. Yes! Okay, one. One hit. Can't get everything. Life. Okay. What did he get here? Uh, when... Did he say? <laughs> when this character dies, the Doomsayer and his allies restore 50 vigor and 50 sanity. Hmm. Well, that's not too bad, but... Let's do this then. And let's see here. 60 and 60. We want this guy definitely out of this stance. Wanted to ground that shit. And then let's see here. Mm, yeah. Let's give this guy even lower as doing anything. And now do we start eating on him? I mean, it's not good to heal the other guys, but essentially, <laughs> essentially they're already healed, so it doesn't do anything really. Kill this guy. Um, just kill him off. Yeah, I'd probably do that. This guy's 60. I don't think we'll still miss them. Oh, we just crit them. Like the bosses we are. It's fine if we seal them. Miss! Double hitter! What a guy. What a guy. Sure. Now then, hopefully he'll miss. <laughs> Doomsayer! Okay, what did this do? Did it deal magical damage? Okay. Hmm. Let's read this. At the beginning of the next turn, deals 100% medical damage to all other characters. I hope this can miss. Hmm. I hope it can. But the thing is. Hmm. 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 We want to bring this guy down also. A little bit yeah. dangerous, not too dangerous. Move those mortal legs. So let's see, and you have whenever a minion moves, attack it for 100% damage. I think we do this. Oh, this award protects against that. Oh, snap the runers. Okay, well, well, that's dangerous. That might kill our shade there. Um, hmm. <laughs> okay, put out the cloud there, maybe, and start. Yep, bring you forward. That is dangerous. We're gonna take a lot of magic damage here. Okay, well, he's still alive on this guy, at least. Okay. Woohoohoo! Miss! <clears throat> yep, we need to start healing this guy, I think. He's very close to that. Come on, miss. <laughs> Please! You dare hit here, <laughs> mister! Uh, okay. So this guy's 90% chance to hit. I'm not liking that one bit. 
uh, actually. So let's do that first. Oof. Well, he's down to 60. That's something. Um, probably put this down here, swap them around. Could do something. I mean, how much? She hasn't barely lost any sanity. Ooh. 60% 35. Yeah, I think we do this again. Probably he will miss here. Hopefully. <laughs> okay. That was lucky. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, we need to start eating up that shield that is... Uh, or that ward, I mean. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, we're alive. Okay. Well, we can do this first. Fortunately, you can only give mana. I guess we just do minus accuracy on you then. That's about all we can do. Hmm. Can recover some vigor. Uh, yeah, maybe I do this. Go forward a little bit. And yeah, we try to bring him down to absolute nothing, <laughs> nothing in uh, hmm, in accuracy. Okay, bring him down. <laughs> it's getting scary. Okay, the end is coming. The end is coming. That is danger ooze. Oh, this will be get warded, unfortunately. Let's see here. We're bringing down the 30% chance to hit, so he shouldn't. He shouldn't hit us, right? How, how far can we bring him down? 25. That's the furthest. Ooh. Oh. We replenish a little bit of vigor here. And some manas. Ooh, this would be good if we had brought down his sanity a little bit, but we have not. Ooh, okay. Well, I guess we can do this. Bring down his health a little bit. <laughs> oh, you're gonna get punish for that, buddy. Missing everyone. <laughs> okay, miss. Okay, uh, we're getting some hits in. Ah, yeah, okay. I think we got him. Got him. It marks you. Every attack against target is a critical hit. Uh, we want to replenish a little bit of mana here. We don't want to use this yet, because then we're gonna kill him. Uh, so, yep, sure. Just use this for the time being. And let's see, the last guy... The last guy, I guess, will use the... Uh, kill spell. Mm. Have a little bit of HP, a little bit of manas. We're up to 84. And you will have to kill this guy now. Yeah. Wink! Move. Got him. <laughs> okay, one shade got very, very damaged there. Except for that, it was a, was a good fight, must say. And level 4 brain. It's not the worst. It's simply not the worst. Mm, okay. Got some more shades here. Uh, you can go back. You can go back. Put you here, put you here. And we got that level 4 brain also, let's put that on. Put that on a shade. Kill. Is this accuracy? Oh, initiative! Ooh, that's quite schmexy, honestly. Okay, accuracy attack. Do we have any better of these? No, we don't. Okay, but it's pretty nice to have extra initiative. So this guy now has initiative 6. And we upgrade this to 8. Ooh, then that new armor can it could probably do something. Uh, for this guy at least. So where's the brain? Where is that brain? Evasion, evasion, luck. Red. Mm, there you are. Level 4 brain. Boink. So these two. And then what do we go for? Some extra evasion. Norse ward. I think this is what we want to go for. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> All is sneezing in this episode. <laughs> sure. Uh, we got everything here, I think. Uh, so you could definitely join the crew here. Sir and you well, do this. Sir, me well, well, my minions. Uh, what level are you? Yeah, you're level 2. I can level you up at least. I don't know if you need to level these guys up. Uh, like this, or if they can get multiple levels, probably can. Trying to hit the things that I should hit. Okay, talents. So we can get one more spell here. We're on our way to uh, battle eternal. Uh, so we can get this for the time being. All minions and enemy min minions gain 10 plus luck until the battle ends. And luck, of course, is chance to crit in this game. So it's a bit risky, but I mean, if they have very, very low accuracy, we might as well go for some crit, maybe. But it's a little bit costly, I don't think. Maybe it works in so uh, you know, depending on the party, it might be very, very good. But it doesn't seem super duper great when I think about it. Uh, yeah, we have everything done there, I think. Let's just go to the next battle. These guys are usually easy. The thing is, they can crit. If they crit you, you just die. Uh, we probably should try to avoid all elites, right? <laughs> That's a smart idea. It's a lot of battles here, but maybe a lot of battles is the way to go. Then we get as much as possible. Uh, I don't know. <sighs> it's very nice to get experience on our guys here also. Hmm. Oh, the swordsmans. Nah, 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 I'd rather have these guys, I think. Swordsmans can be good against us. If I remember correctly, they have an insanely high accuracy. Might remember that wrong. <laughs> Don't quote me on that. <laughs> they have shit accuracy or something. 100 and 100. Uh, and this guy... 175. Well... Well, I think for this guy we start uh, smacking him with some magic damage. And then for these guys we just try to get... Them as low as possible on accuracy. Wink. Shuffle them around a couple of times. And this guy. Oh, the trap. Don't like the trap. Okay, miss and block. That's good. He gets a smack from that. And the next guy. Block. Block. Eat up our block pretty quickly here. Well, 90% becomes 60. And this guy probably just charges in there. Yeah, buffs himself up. We'll take him last, I think. This guy gets some accuracy. So let's see here. Can go for more. Should we go for the magic damage on the stone golem? Yeah, probably. It takes a while to bring down though with this. Takes a while, well, need to start working on it at some point, so. This guy has 80% accuracy. This guy has 60, so I guess you. The golem, though, only has 60% accuracy, so. Let's see. Okay, we direct it to him. It's a little bit dangerous when he stands in the front there, because that's the only time he can hit. Otherwise, he needs to move forward. Okay, miss and miss. Perfect. So let's move this guy to the front instead. Out 50% accuracy. Oh, he can attack from position 2. Didn't even know that. Okay. He's getting smacked back. He has a lot of armor, but no medical armor. Mm, he's not missing any sanity. So he's not going to take damage from this. Oof. I want to push this guy forward. Probably. Weirdly enough. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. Work on you. 90%. Yeah, 90% is a little bit high. I feel like. I feel like he might make that 90% hit. 60, 50. Yeah, I guess you. Is that the 30%? Probably not gonna hit. Uh, one block. Pretty close to the other. 
Okay. So let's see here. This guy has 70% now. Debuff him. <laughs> miss, please. Miss, miss. Perfect. I wish you would attack two times back if they missed. Because they missed two times, but that doesn't happen. Golem just charging up here. Well. This guy's 80% still. Amazing. 50. Mm, okay, so here we get to do some more magic damage. I love that there's a strategy like this where they just kill themselves on the hardest difficulty also. <laughs> the hardest difficulty they kill themselves. Ooh, the trap. The problem with the traps is we can't really do anything about them in this part. We don't have it. Okay. One crit, one miss. Get punished then. Okay, now we get this thing. This thing might be quite useful to put out here. What position? I think we put it in the first position still. You're usually just shuffling these two guys around. Miss, miss. That's good. Perfect. Oh, and a crit. Beautiful. Insane. In the membrane. Okay. Well, now we might want to shuffle this guy forward. <laughs> the dangerous thing is, as you can see, <laughs> 35 to 7 damage. Deals insane damage. The problem is, yes, <laughs> he misses. And then we smack rank him. Smack will dank him. Uh, now we can just kill this guy, right? Yeah. He's dead. And now we can just shuffle you two around. Miss? Oh. Oh, what a guy, huh? Debuff you. Get you in front there. Oh, he hits! What a guy! What a guy. Well, I think we can kill off this guy now. I think. I think that should be enough. Yep. Oh, okay, he moves when he does that. Oh. oh. The thing is here with the traps. I can't use this, really. I would love to use it, but I can't. What's up? I'm so sad. Mm hmm. Okay, now we can use it. Now we can use it. Perfect. Now let's do a replenish round then. I did 35. Everyone just healing up, getting the manas back. 35% chance. Probably not gonna happen. No. This strategy is so... <laughs> I love this strategy. I played so many other strategies. And uh, this just felt the best. He will probably flee, I think, <laughs> before we kill him. And we will heal up the fuller. Yep. All that juicy mana's back. Please. It's willing to play. But it's gonna get punished. Don't have smack there. Should have run. Should have run, buddy. Came to the wrong neighborhood. Yep. Smack down. We got a little bit of damage on this guy. But we're pretty good shaper. Yep. Pretty sweet, I must say. Let's see here what, uh, what shades we have. I have a level 2 shade, level 2 shade. We have a damaged one here. Yeah, we do. Let's put you. Oh, you're level 3. That's amazing. Okay. Well, heal you up a little bit. What? What? Uh, 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 <laughs> oh yeah, you need to go in here to click on the plus. Forgot about that. Okay. Uh, you need a little bit of healing. Uh, you can do a little bit of healing. Here. That's pretty sweet. We need two more points to get this uh, full heal magic. Where is it? This thing. Hmm. That's about it, I think. Let's go into the next battle. Okay. Sacrifice a minion. Iritus receives items and artifacts. Yeah, we can sacrifice this Dark Knight. I don't need that. Sacrifice the Dark Knight. Okay, let's see here. If Iritus ends a battle with 5 mana or less, he restores additional 30 mana. Uh, that's pretty good, but this is never going to happen, really. Uh, then we have these things. Evasion, Soul Game Dread. 2 armor. 
All of these are really that exciting, honestly. Uh, debuff can target gives plus one initiative. Five evasion is probably the best. On striking critical hit, we also restore two mana. I think the demonic essence is where we want to be with this. Uh, who do we put that on then? Uh, we have a lot of level four here, I guess. Yes, you get that. Uh, where was it? Okay, this gives armor. This gives evasion. Now we're up to 22. Let's go into our artifacts then. So here we have all enemies lose a ward at the beginning of each battle. That's pretty good. Uh, we also have this thing. Where if anything has at least 8 initiative, it gains 8 accuracy and 8 evasion. Which is amazing, of course. Truly amazing. Uh, which one is best? I think for the time being, before we have uh, 8 initiative, everyone, we only have one guy with 8 initiative. He will, of course, get very good evasion <laughs> if we do that, but I think... Skip that for now. Uh, so you then. Oh, didn't we put on an item on this guy? Maybe we didn't. Plus one attack. Attack initiative. Do we do the armor here? Uh, maybe. Put on some dread. Attack plus one initiative on debuffing. Yeah, we will debuff a lot. So I guess that could be something. Something. Uh, yeah. Let's continue on. Do we take the elite fight? I don't see really any much incentive in doing the elite fights. We don't get much extra for doing it. Oh, but this is a swordsman. Oh! I like fighting swordsman. There's another swordsman here. This route seems easier. But there's an elite fight here. Ah! Oh, okay, no pain, no <laughs> Is this where the battle ends? We'll see. Oh. Ooh, depending on what it is, it could be quite difficult. Oh, a swordsman here. Ooh, and the axe guy. Okay, he misses at least. Thing is, whenever he misses, he gets a buff, I think. So we need to bring this guy down quick. Um. Hmm. Okay. How do we bring this guy down the quickest? He doesn't have much HP. He doesn't have much... I think we do soul leech on this guy. Uh, and then we use... The other ability later on. Yeah, so use Soul Lich for the time being. And this guy is probably the most dangerous right now because if he hits us, he will likely crit a 75% chance to crit. And if he crits us, uh, then he stuns. So, yeah, I think. Oh, that misses. He doesn't even have evasion. How can we miss this guy? Oh, we a 4% chance of missing? Uh, well, it's gonna happen, I guess. Just didn't think it happened right then. Mm -hmm. uh, and then this guy would be pretty good to uh, get a little bit further. Front here. The front lines. Okay. Marks him. And puts him to the front. Okay. He did do a miss there, though. No? Sorb. Oh, he has 23 magic resistance. Oh, that guy will be a little bit of a hassle to deal with. Okay, and the swordsman misses, misses, but then he gets a buff. 18. Okay. So I think we continue with this guy. Uh, what? Steadfast. Oh! Oh, receives one block and one ward at the start of each turn. Okay. <laughs> Oh, that's bad. Bad. Well, let's see here. I think we bring you down. Boot you forth first. Uh, and then we need to start doing this, I think. Yeah. And start shuffling these guys around. Hopefully this guy will miss a little bit now. He has 4% chance to hit, so... Yeah, misses all of us. <laughs> gonna get so punished for that. Well, not so much when I think about it, because he has 23 magic armor, <laughs> except for that. Oh, It'd be so nice if we could ignore magic armor somehow, some way. Hmm, well, this guy's 95. 
Uh, 70. Let's bring this guy forward. Miss! 28% chance. Logic. Oh, he misses. That's good. Okay. Well, I want to bring this guy forward, weirdly enough. Okay, crit debuff. Does it do anything extra then? No. Miss. Okay. It's a smack, but it's blocked by the sheet. No. Misses. Hmm. Well, I guess we focus on bringing this guy down then. So, yeah. He's close. Close to down. Let's see here. 75. Would be sweet to... Oh yeah, he has ward. That's so good. That's so good for him to gain that ward thing. Sure. Uh, Headman kills a target if it doesn't miss. 100% accuracy. Hmm. Well, we can bring the other guys to the front then. This guy will probably hit 70%. Oh, double miss though. Oh, he hurts his own troops. Didn't even think about that. Okay. Well, but that elite mage is dangerous. Very, very dangerous. So too is this guy. All very dangerous. How do we deal with this guy? We <laughs> essentially only have magic damage. This is fist. No, this is magical. Well, if we can bring down his sanity somehow. Bring down his sanity. We can do... Or <laughs> please, okay, hit there at least. Mm. Oh, we have the cloud. We can do do the cloud thing on him. Hmm. So let's see here. Probably want to ah so so dangerous. This guy is killing our party way too quickly here. We need to bring him down somehow. Can't do it to magic damage. We can do this insanity thing on him. And we can bring him to the front here. Okay, marks that guy. He comes to the front. Okay, misses. That's good. And we miss him. Yep. Well, now we have the cloud at least. The cloud of darkness. So we can put that out. And he has, only has a 40% chance of hitting. So he's not probably going to hit too much here. Hopefully. Okay, that misses. That's good. Okay. Damage. This guy... Okay, so shuffle these guys around a little bit. Keep up there. Try to make them stab this as much as possible. I also want to bring this guy down, of course. He doesn't have any magic armor, so we can do a little bit of this. And, yep. Hopefully we'll get this off also. With debuff. Perfect. Little miss here. Yeah, miss, miss. And miss. <laughs> we always miss him also. Hmm. Thing is, this guy has pretty high chance of hitting now, so I think we debuff. Oh yeah, he has ward. Oh, well. Well, well, well. Okay. okay. Now it's debuffed. Now it's pretty low chance, I would say. Hmm. Do we start the healing process now? Uh, no, I think we're still, still just shuffling them around. Just deal damage to them. Yes, that's good. Crit him! <laughs> One damage. Okay. 14 damage. Okay, that guy will become a problem. Okay, he shoves himself to the front though. Okay, this guy's 33, this guy has 73 HP. Mm hmm. 
So let's see here. If we shuffle these two guys around and then do a magic damage on them. This guy probably will die. Yeah, 23. So now he's dead. And this guy has a mark. Initiative. That's the only thing. 40%. 100%. I think we shuffle them around. Miss. Okay. You done. Crit debuff. Okay. Now I think we start healing. I think we start healing. I think we're fine now. They're probably not gonna hit us now. Probably. <laughs> see. Okay, miss. Sword resistance. Okay. So this guy has 100%. Uh, this guy has 70%. So if we shuffle, shuffle this guy to the front, I think this guy can only hit from the front. Thinking. That's the case. Uh, so you heal. Think. It's a little bit dangerous with this guy, though. I would love to have him a little bit... Back. At all possible. Oh, this guy has... They have no... Uh, no evasion, so we should be able to safely do this, though. Debuff this guy. Betrayal! <laughs> okay. And these guys... Should not be trusted. Uh, let's see here. 40%, 50%. Yeah, I think we're just doing the healing here. Healing moves. Ah, he is. These guys are marked. This guy could be dangerous, I guess. Could do a soul leech on him and then... Uh, yeah, soul leech. Blocked by that, that's perfect. And then we could just eat, try eating it up with this. Oh, very close. Eating up with this one. As worthless as you were in life, that's good. You will be worth something in death. And now this guy has 4% chance to hit. I guess we bring that down a little bit lower. And <laughs> put this on also. Now we just do healing. Now we just do healing. Oh yeah, misses. Sorb. Yep, and then we start the heal train. Well, you can't, so. I guess you just do this. But everyone else does it. Okay, two manas. Sweet. Can't do this if you stand in the front. Apparently. Miss. Back him. Never ending battle between those guys. Four. Four manas. I think we're just gonna use the guys who have healing. Just want full HP and everyone. 70% chance to hit, huh? Well... <laughs> uh, you also have healing. I uh, guess we have to. Guess we have to do this. Debuff him. 40%. Miss. Good, good, good. Good, good. Now we get another round of this. This is so good! <laughs> uh... Yeah, you can't do anything else, so might as well. Buff. You have mana only. I have full mana already. I can swap places with this guy. That he can uh, use some healing abilities instead. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, you're fully healed. Okay. Sure. Maybe everyone is fully healed who can heal. This guy. Ah, oh, this guy did not have full, full HP. Very important. Uh, yeah, maybe we just kill him now. Ah, oh, not with this. How do we kill him? <laughs> we, oh, we kill him with the claw, of course. And oh, the claw's magic damage. It deals much damage. I think we can get past his shield with this. 25? That's respectable, I would say. Yes. Damage, no. Uh, you can heal, though. Wink. 
And you can smack him. Got him! Godly got him. The elite fight! Down! <laughs> I love this game. It's a little bit slow, yes, to play with this kind of party, but on this difficulty... <laughs> you kind of need to do this, it feels like. It's so much more difficult. I mean, it doesn't seem that difficult, but it's because I'm taking everything very, very... <laughs> playing very, very safely. So thank you so much for watching, and see you next time!